do you know that there is something called the hard water and the soft water well don't be confused the term hard or soft has nothing to do with the softness or hardness of the water it has nothing to do with the touch and feel of it then what is it well it is actually about chemical compounds that are dissolved in water so what are these chemical compounds that are dissolved in water let's see when rain water falls it is naturally very soft but as it makes its way to the ground and into the waterways it picks up certain minerals on the way such as chalk lime and mostly it picks up calcium and magnesium this calcium and magnesium changes its softness into hardness and rain water becomes hard water so what is hard water well hard water contains high mineral content with calcium and magnesium so water which will have a high content of calcium and magnesium will be known as hard water now then what is soft water well soft water is water with higher sodium content but small concentration of this calcium and magnesium so what did we study hard water has more of calcium and magnesium whereas the soft water it has less of calcium and magnesium but more of sodium content now suppose you are having two glasses of water and you want to check which glass has hard water in it and which glass has soft water in it what will you do well you can add some amount of soap in both the glasses of water and the glass which has soft water in it which produce more foam or you can say more lather in it while the glass which has hard water will produce less amount of soap that is less amount of foam or less amount of lather as compared to the soft water so what did we study that soft water produces a good lather with soap now this is the reason why most people use soft water for cleaning purposes like even for bathing you can use it and uh, as you know that it produces good lather washing clothes in soft water will give you a good amount of foam now you know that in soft water some minerals are absent so that is why your clothes will not even turn reddish due to the absence of such minerals so washing of clothes in soft water will increase the life of the clothes now on the other hand there are some people who prefer hard water for drinking now why is it so now hard water contains some minerals which is not present in soft water now these minerals give a better taste to the water and these minerals are also healthy for your body you need it it is essential for your body so that is why some people prefer hard water for drinking as these minerals are essential for their body but you cannot argue on this topic as there are still studies going on whether you should drink hard water or soft water so you know that water can be classified into hard water and soft water depending upon what minerals they contain in them